What are the best NSFW life hacks? Cold water gets come off skin much better than hot water. Fun fact, cold water also gets blood out of fabric. I can finally get those murder stains out to my carpet. When 699 is the guy under the gal, have your arms under her thighs, no over. Diagram needed? Water by the bed, or adjacent to sex setting, minimizes reducing the mood, while keeping you hydrated, and hopefully cramp free in those long bouts. If you're using water based lube, keep a spray bottle full of water nearby. Just lightly mist when lube starts to get gummy. Instant lube rejuvenation. And towels. Have a few on hand. Lube and sex juice get everywhere. I'm sure this is actually good advice, but the thought of pulling out a spray bottle and misting someone's vulva is cracking me up. <laughs> Buy a fuck blanket, you throw it out, and can romp for hours without soaking the sheets. Throw it in the wash and you're done. Also travels great. Edit. I should also mention that a quality fuck blanket doesn't allow water or lube to soak through. So more of a fuck tarp rather than a fuck blanket. Hey babe, did you set up the fuck tent? <laughs> Ask your partner what they like or don't like or always wanted to try. Alternatively, just poop right on their chest. You have a 50-50 shot of them loving it. <laughs> Farts will come out quicker and smoother if you're laying on your left side has to do with how your bowels are situated. This is a godsend in bed at night during the two days leading up to my period. Laying on your left also works for heartburn bc of the shape of your stomach and the esophagus attaches more towards the right. <laughs> Hygiene. Trim your fingernails. Long nails hurt. Also, if you know in advance you are getting lucky, but haven't showered the entire day, take one. But don't trim your nails just before, though. Or use a nail file. What if my kink is Freddy Krueger cosplay? <laughs> Speed does not equal pleasure. Start slow and methodical and slowly go faster. Don't just rely on your dick either. Whisper in her ear. Kiss her neck. Kiss from her neck to her pussy and once you get down there really give it to her. And tell her how much you love her body. And how good she makes you feel. Or bad if that's what you're into. Also when eating pussy don't just lick. Curl your tongue and do little circles. Actual sexual things are amazing, but being told how much my body turns them on or how amazing they find it is the icing on the cake. Definitely do this. It helps a lot with confidence and feeling sexy. The underneath sides of the boobs are more sensitive than the top of them and the cleavage. First hand, second hand, or both hand experience, I have the boobs. It is okay to laugh during sex. Having fun makes you more relaxed and playful. What if she laughs at your penis? What happens if you laugh at her dick? <laughs> Guys, don't be afraid to make your orgasm loud and obvious. It's unbelievably hot when you don't hold back. One time my wife was giving me a blowjob, and I had a flashback of a porno I watched a while ago. Right when I came I screamed UHHH drop in loads. Cum came out of her nose from the sudden intense laughter this caused her 1010 over drop loads again. <laughs> Thinking of receiving anal in a few minutes and douching beforehand? Wetter is not better. If you use too much water and it gets into your colon, it's coming back out in a few minutes with force. Stop when you just start to feel pressure. If you're giving yourself an enema before anal, you better have more than a few minutes to clean yourself out. Otherwise you'll be getting warmed up and bam that diarrhea feeling. <laughs> when licking her clit, put one hand on her mons pubis area and gently press upward to pull her skin and labia taut. This exposes the clit and adds to sensitivity. My ex did this all the time until I caught on and made it part of our thing. Current partner approves. Edit, it has been brought to my attention that I made a typo. Indeed, it should be mom's pubis. Current partner approves. How the fuck does having my hand on her mom help? <laughs> give your sewer foot massage after 6 if you want to give them a real treat. Your pleasure centers are all warmed up and it is practically as good as the sex itself but lasts as long as you want it to. Just don't do it to Marcellus's wife. That's how you get thrown out a window. <laughs> Gently put pressure on a woman's lower stomach while having sex. It helps both I've found. So where would you suggest putting the chips and salsa, then? <laughs> Keep your hand around the small of her back and make sure her clit is rubbing against your pelvic bone. Edit, or if the position doesn't cater to this, 
get a bullet vibrator and use it half a use it. Put a pillow under her lower back, and same with pubic bone on clit action. <laughs> Thanks for watching, if you liked my video, go ahead and check out my other content, and also don't forget to like, and subscribe, for new videos, if you loved the video leave a comment.